Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap. Today's Tuesday, September 29th, plus $364.50 today. So not a huge green day, but actually let me do this. Uh, I've already got my sheet filled out. So let's break it down by strategy. So a uh, nice morning with the Mighty 90 strategy. Had four trades, uh, one in Apple for 100 bucks, one in MU for 133, and then a real nice one in NVIDIA. Had one in BABA, ended up scratching the trade exactly. So total profit on our Mighty 90s on the day, 708. I counted the scratch as a loser, even though I lost zero. So, uh, But if it's not a winner, in my mind, it is a loser. So uh, six total trades on the week and really 100% winning, kind of, minus that one uh, scratch trade, but total weekly P&L in the mighty 90s, uh, 861. Did two pairs trades today. Uh, one in the Russell NASDAQ was a small loser, and then gold, silver was a small winner. That one could have been a, a really nice winner. I took, I took it off a little bit early. And then the runners, another losing day in the runners. So had a pretty sizable loser in Beyond, sizable loser in Facebook, Intel, scratch trade in RH. In Roku, I took a couple different trades. One was a loser. One was a really nice winner. Uh, Netflix, pretty sizable loser. Tesla, a little winner. Uber, scratch, and a really nice winner in NVIDIA. So let's take a look at what we did here. Uh, let me move this off the screen. All right, so our mighty 90s, let's start with those uh, going with Apple. All right, so an Apple had this big initial push down. And so this is where we got long about right here and was able to ride that up. Just rode it back up to the pivot for a small winner, $100, $100 winner on that one. MU, profit of 133. Let's take a look at MU. Uh, so MU had that big push higher, and we just caught a little piece of this. Didn't hold on to it very long because it was super strong. So I didn't I didn't catch all this. Just caught a little piece for a small winner. And then my nice winner was Nvidia, and this was actually called out by one of our members in the room. Uh, had this big push up, and then this pullback got long here and rode this thing all the way up. It started to falter. We got out, booked a nice winner of 475 there. Uh, onto the runners, uh, beyond. Okay, so this one was a little frustrating. Uh, beyond had a nice big push higher, started to consolidate above this pivot. Was at all time highs, super high probability trade. Started to move up. I was up about 10%, took some off, uh, started coming back down. I added to it and then it just kind of flushed me out. So ended up taking a, a decent loss on that one. Facebook. Let's see. And Facebook, what did we do? Was that a. Uh, a long or a short? Yeah, that was a long. Okay, yeah. So uh, Facebook made this big push higher, started to pull back, uh, got long right in here, looking for a continuation, and it just really flushed me out. So took a loss on Facebook. Intel. Uh, Intel was a, just double checking my platform here. Okay, so Intel, actually two different trades. One was a short, one was a long. Uh, so Intel, um, Actually, I cannot remember what I did. Oh, I, I know I got short here when it made a big push low. Below the lows of the day, started consolidating. I was looking for a continuation lower and it just flushed me out. So I, I bailed on that one. Um, <clears throat> next trade, uh, RH. So this is one that we, are we took while we were still live in the room. Big push up, started to consolidate, uh, or excuse me, came down. And uh, and I was, I was long, ended up, I had a, <clears throat> had a decent profit on this at one point, and then it came back down, and I think it was right here. I just ended up getting out for a scratch on that. Okay, so Roku. Roku had a uh, – uh, both were short trades. One was a – excuse me, one, one short, one long. The short was a loser, so we had this big push down, started to consolidate, and I was looking for a continuation lower. It kind of pushed me out, and I bailed before before this happened. On the long side, it, it then started to rally, came into positive territory, start, started uh, consolidating here, and I caught a big chunk of this move right here. Uh, so ended up positive in Roku overall, $340 positive there. Netflix was another loser. And let's see, Netflix. What did we do in Netflix? 
Uh, I think I tried to get short down here and I got flushed. Out. Yeah, got flushed out of that one. And then Tesla. So Tesla, this was a little bit after we left the room. This was uh, right here at about 1030. I uh, had a big push up in Tesla and then just started consolidating a positive territory. So I caught a little, uh, little winner there. Uber was a scratch trade. Uh, NVIDIA was my biggest winner, over 1300 bucks in NVIDIA. So NVIDIA was strong all day. I, I talked about you know wanting to get long NVIDIA, was just kind of going, 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 and then started to made this big push above the highs of the day, started to pull back, and I caught a big piece of this here. And in fact, uh, so it came down, I, I scaled out with some right at the pivot, held some, and got out you know, pretty close to the top. Then we had a little bit of a pullback to the pivot, got in again and, and rode some of this up. So really nice winner in NVIDIA. Overall, like I said, a tiny, uh, small loser in uh, the runners, but overall plus 364.50 for the day and done by uh, before one o'clock by about 12.30. So decent day of trading, uh, much better than yesterday. So hopefully we'll keep this trend going the rest of the week. Have a good day. If you have any questions, let me know.